Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. So I was going to run over to Timmy's, but I said, no, I feel like egg today. And me and, yeah, I said, I feel like toast and just an order, you know, plain breakfast and my yogurt and my coffee. So I got my batteries. Oh, my goodness. I think the night before when I called them, that night or whatever, they might have got a hold of the driver. Because I look at the packaging, and it does say 212, so it was his error. It wasn't the error in the address. He, he tried doorbell 213, which is across there, and she's not home at that time. She's working. And she probably didn't answer or something because he wouldn't have, well, unless he just walked in. They'll do that sometime, too, if someone lets them in. But the, he did put that little paper. That's how I knew. On 213. So, yeah, but I did get them. So this weekend, I'll get them put in. And then I gotta charge it probably 12 hours anyway, right? I'll read the instruction. And uh, Sunday, so it's at 45 minutes. Sunday, I might just drive around here for 20. I go somewhere for 20 minutes and come back. Maybe Talford to the lake. Because even if it doesn't charge, it might have been whatever. I can always walk it, not that. But, yeah, those batteries are going to work. But I don't understand because I never got them wet. I could see, because I never throw my scooter in the rain, ever. Through a water puddle or... It's not that high, see. It's not that high. They got small tires. But like I said before in the comments, I did re read a couple of people had trouble with batteries. Not, well, I think maybe one or two. That's when mine started acting up. I read the comments. But some people let them go dead or sat for a long time without charging and I didn't do that, see, but, so if I would have read, read the comments, they were all, all good comments, it was only a couple, I probably still would have purchased it. I would have still purchased it. And Paula, Paula sent me PayPal, and as soon as I received it, I got my, I got, I got it coming Saturday. Um, it's that topper thing that I was talking about. I think it's going to be good. I think I'm going to put the white topper on and fold over like, like a bed skirt. And my brown one, beige, brown, would probably fit over it. But I, it's going to be a lot better. Because when I stayed over, every, see La Fonda when they were staying here. She slept in my bed once. And she was like, that your, your bed is hard compared to mine or something. So every time I go over there to spend a night or whatnot, so I would say, you can sleep in my bed, you can sleep in my bed. And I really don't want to sleep in, but I did the other night, eh? I said, my goodness, my mattress is hard. So I went over yesterday. 
she swelled a little bit, not like... She just got to get blood work done. Who was talking to do? She's been on that thyroid medication for a long time. Her thyroid started acting up when she had Leah. She gained a lot of pounds, a lot of pounds, like when she was a month, two months pregnant, and they couldn't give her the strongest dose. She was pregnant, but. Yeah, after she had Leah, they boosted it right up. And so she'd been on it for 11, 12 years. So I had to run the water. They're supposed to take it off here soon. I got the tub full, I got that full, I got... So I want to lay down a bit. And I put the tub hot, so... By the time I'm ready to take a shower and everything. Or not shower, but wash up. It'll be warm. It won't be freezing cold. They work on one apartment and they get to show the, shut the whole building down. Because we just had water outage maintenance or whatever you call it Wednesday. I hear them out in the hallway. They're doing whatever. But. I don't know. Yeah. So, got my battery. I'm gonna have my bed thing. I think it'll work. Anything would make that bed com more comfortable. It was brand new mattress though, but he never even slept on it. That was here. I bought the dash and that, like that sofa thing and the mattress. He had the air mattress, so I know the landlord when we came and looked at the place. She said he's sleeping on a, he never used a stove. I don't think. He didn't use the fridge. He didn't use the dishwasher. He slept in there. In the living room. So I got a good deal. For all the stuff that was left behind. Mm. So anyhow, yeah, something going on out in the hallway. I can have water anyway. Today is Friday. It's supposed to be a cold day. I think I'm going to wear my heavy jacket today. supposed to be cold. Yesterday was nice. But today is supposed to be cold. We weren't busy at work. Pretty quiet. Pretty quiet. And I could say, thinking it's going to be quiet today, but because of weather, and, but then probably be busy. I would not bet on, on that. This guy, just before closing, Oh, about a half hour before closing. He comes in. And he left a whole bunch of stuff in the garbage. I looked in one of the bags. 
it was clean like I had a bunch of cleaning stuff well I grabbed a hold of that the bay cleaner he found cigars and he grabbed a hold of them all different things I was going to eat lots of garbage so it's in the garbage it wasn't like it was on the floor beside the garbage it was in the garbage so I said whatever you want take it because it got to be sewn out because sometimes somebody will take stuff out of the car and put it beside the garbage can and they mean to put it back and they don't they're back like 10 minutes not very not very long but this was in the garbage so that meant it was garbage just thinking this morning thank god i remember i was going to turn the dishwasher on i have to do my dishes when i come home it's all loaded and ready to go Yeah. So LaFonda's good. Bro should be getting his truck back soon. Yeah. Jenny came over the other day. She was biking to friends. The kids were both in school until 3.30 or so. And she came about 10.30 or so. I was laying down. Halfway there. She was halfway from her place and asked if she could come in, get a drink of water, rest. I said, well, of course. She was biking with her bike. So she biked to her friends and biked back, which is good. Which is good. To do more now. With the kids and out on the weekend. Because summer, right? Eh? Winter's pretty hard. Take them to the park and all that if you don't have a vehicle, you know. So, the pipes aren't out in the hallway. Why are they out in the hallway? Our heat's not the water. It's um, natural gas or whatever. I don't know what they're doing out there. Anyhow, as long as I, I got the tub full hot water right now, because I want to lay down by the time I wake up, it'll be, I got the kitchen sink one, I got that, and the bathroom sink full hot water. Yeah. Got the battery. I wasn't complaining about the uh, shipping. I would. I just want let her, let let you know that if she paid for shipping and I pay, because sometimes you can't trust some people too, right? Maybe she can get her money back. I'd say, look, the other end paid, but I think the reason why I had to pay, it had the weight. So it must have been something to do with the weight, I'm thinking. Because they wouldn't put it on there. You know what I mean? So, it was something to do with the weight. Because they're heavy. Small little batteries, but man, they're heavy, eh? Yeah. Do my scooter. But, 
I'm not going to drive it back and forth to work, though. But, like I said, I can go to Telford, go to Jenny's on the weekend if I got to go down to the dollar store, Tiger, um, just as on 20 minutes there and 20 minutes back. The full charge is 45 minutes on it. And that's all I need for all the little areas around here, you know. I'm going to get another basket, black one with, with the cage. <clears throat> I put the blue dollar store basket. But I think I'll, I think I can get them at Canadian Tire. I'm going to do a blue cage, or a black cage. And I can put a cloth in it. Yeah, put a cloth in it and pin it so that uh, nothing will fall through the holes, you know what I mean? Yeah. But I really don't like that blue. It's like plastic and it just, it don't. It usually come with cages, you know, in the back or front. So, thank you guys. I appreciate it. And you never know on a nice sunny night, a set of, or a sunny day, whatever, in like June or probably July, July and August. If I feel like scooter, and I might scooter, you know. I might scooter. Yeah. And then, got, and then I got a lot to do. I got two weeks and first week of July off. So. And I think if I scooter to. Because I don't even. I like the church though. I like to watch the fireworks July 1st at the church. Hmm. Because they got that food thing. I suppose I could go there, eat and do what I have to do, listen music, come home. If I did that about three, come home four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Six hours I could plug it in. Charge it for six hours gives me a little bit. I should have enough to go to my spot that I like the fireworks and back. I did that. Fireworks don't start until 10. I could go there 12, 1 o'clock, spend an hour or so, listen to music and then come back home because I don't think I'd have enough battery to go from there to there to there. I, w I would have to add it up from here to LRC and then from the LRC to the church and back home. Eight from there to there. Thirteen twenty. I might have. I'll add it up. I'll do the map. Uh, the Google map. Is I could stay there longer. I put a blanket and everything in my in that basket. So have something to set on, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I think that's what I'll do. I think that's what I'll do. Oh, so. Today's Friday. late to do my it's a little bit later I woke up at 6 in the morning I said I'm not getting up that's too early went to go lay down I said maybe I'll get up an hour an hour no two hours after so I'm a little late today but I must need it to sleep usually I get up at 6 I wake up at 7 
7.30, almost 8. But yeah. So they must be working on the pipes on this side. I seen them. Um, they, they repair. They repair as people moving out. And I seen a um, moving truck yesterday, so. But I don't know who's moving out. Could be upstairs too, and it, or downstairs. People comes and goes a lot. Now my rent went up fifty dollars, but La Fonda, they got all all new windows and everything, and hers only went up by twenty five dollars. What's up with that? They didn't do my windows. I didn't get my windows done. Okay, they got all new washers and dryers. Okay, I can see that, but mine should only went up by twenty five dollars, not fifty. I'm in a one bedroom. There's just going up. They gave three, three months notice or whatever that it's going up. So they've been here almost a year. Wow. Because I know they were here for a few months living with me. Time's fly, eh? Is that rent notice? They give that out three months ahead of time. Yeah, they've been here that long, I suppose, eh? At $25. She thought it was going to go up 100 if my I said, I can't see it doing, them doing that. What they got is pretty cheap for three, for three bedroom. One bath, balcony. The only downfall, you don't get your own washer and dryer, but you pay a little bit more. And across the way, I think you pay your lights too, see, because you got your own washer and dryer. It's the same and it's for a three bedroom. So you gotta pay your light, right? So I prefer not to pay the lights and have the washer and dryer for how much I use it, you know? So I gotta upload this. I'm gonna lay down for a little bit. Get up. Find out if we got water when I get up. I take shower about 12.15. The water might be because I forgot on Monday or Tuesday, wh whatever day, that they were shutting the water off. But she gives you like two, three day notice, right? I wasn't thinking. I went and used, I went and slapped, got up 12.15. Go take shower, I had water and everything. And when I got out, it was a notification from her. The water is back on. I forgot all about it. I already took my shower. <laughs> oh, man. My luck, my... Uh, just lucky that my hair was an awful soap. And, but I got some water in the fridge that it, it'd be cold, but at least I would be able to rinse myself off, you know. But I didn't, I, I kind of figured, I uh, forgot about today, but then I remembered, I better, something just told me, there's something water off today. So, thank you guys for the batteries, and my goodness, and that bed thing, that's going to make a difference. I don't think I really need a memory foam, foam and all that, but what you sent me, it was identical to how much, because I could have probably went through Jenny or La Ponda and got free delivery because of Prime. But the delivery was only five something. So why bother them? It wasn't that expensive. I could have two dollars more or something. Could have got it today. But I was like, I'm not going to spend that extra two bucks for a day. So, yeah, I get it Saturday. I'm going to put it right over the mattress and then I'm going to take the brown skirting that I do have and put over it and then that'd be perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. That 
that was on my just a little bit more comfort you know just a little bit on the mattress it has like a thing on top but it's not comfort it's it's not they all have that thing on top like a little I don't know what to call it but 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 he could have brought it bought it firm because he was sleeping on the on the floor or air mattress so maybe because you can buy it like that so maybe the mattress is supposed to be firm but you can get all different uh, things too that's what I'm thinking because it's, nobody slept on it and for that to be so hard and firm it must be how the, the mattress is supposed to be you know because when I went and got my queen size one there I went in and laid on the beds and seen which one was more comfortable and so I think it must be a firm mattress that's Okay, so better shut up and upload this and have my <coughs> have my cigarette and lay down for about an hour. So you guys all have a good day and stay safe and cigarette time.